is with us. Kill any who resist. Do we have him? Call Draper at your service, sir. As far as he... The world. Herr Draper. I want the world. See, sind Sie verrückt? Überall Wasserstoff. Really? That's so frightening. Don't wander off. Where's Quartermain? The gentleman at the back. Do I have the pleasure of addressing Alan Quatermain? Uh, yes, you do, sir. Indeed, you do. You're not what I expected. And I presume you're another traveler. Got it in your head to sample the dark continent. And while you're at it, hunt down old Alan Quatermain and have him tell his adventures. Well... Well, do you uh, fill a seat, sir? You can fill my glass, Bruce. And I'll regale you with how I found King Solomon's mines, or I could relate my... It is not your past that interests me. Uh, um... My name is Sanderson Reed. I am a representative of Her Majesty's British government. The Empire needs you. But the question is, do I need the Empire? Perhaps I should toddle off, should I, Ellen? Yes, of course, Nigel, you toddle off. Toddling. Nigel is useful for keeping the story seekers at bay. I'm Quatermain. The Empire is in peril. You're probably too young to know, but the Empire is always in some kind of peril. We need you to lead a team of unique men, like yourself, to combat this threat. Regale me. There is great unrest. 
countries set at each other's throats, baying for blood. It's a powder keg. The trouble of which I speak could set a match to the whole thing. War. With whom, exactly? Everyone. A world war. That notion makes you sweat? Heavens, man. Doesn't it you? This is Africa, dear boy. Sweating is what we do. Where is your sense of patriotism? God save the Queen. God save the Queen. God bless her. God bless her. That's about as patriotic as it gets around here. But you're Alan Quatermain. Stories of your exploits have thrilled English boys for decades. That I know. And Nigel has done a grand job reminding me. But with each past exploit, I've lost friends. White men and black. And much more. And I'm not the man I once was. The gentleman of the day. What you're saying is you're in for the long exactly. haul. Exactly. Mr. Quartermain? Uh, yes, indeed, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Wrong quarter, me. That's him. Get down. They're indestructible. No, just armor plated. Automatic rifles. Who in God's name has automatic rifles? Death unsporting. Covered in bells of you. Wasn't there another one of these buggers? Mr. Quatermain! Bruce Matilda. Our friend might have some information. But he's so far away. Yes. I thought he was. God, I hate getting old. Did you mean to just wound him? Obviously. Stop him! I need information! Bloody poison. 
You may have no love for the Empire, but I know you love Africa. A war in Europe will spread to its colonies. <laughs> It appears the war has arrived. Very well, Reed. I'm in. Excellent. Pack for an English summer. You made good time getting here. Not as good as Phileas Fogg. Around the world in 80 days. I don't like theatrics. After Africa's belts, London's weather isn't helping your mood. I see. Identify yourself. I'm known by many names, Mr. Quatermain. My underlings call me Sir. My superiors call me M. M. Just M. I must say the delight is mine, meeting so notable a recruit to this newest generation of the League of Extraordinary Gentlemen. League of what? There have been other times when a danger upon the world required the services of singular individuals. How oh, very curious. This museum is full of the curious. Alan Quatermain, Captain Nemo. I know of Mr. Quatermain. And I know of you, Captain. Rumor has it that you're a pirate. I'd prefer a less provocative title. I'm sure you would. Gentlemen, please. Nations are striking at nations. Every attack marked by the use of highly advanced weaponry. They've discovered these attacks are all the work of one man who calls himself the Phantom. Very operatic. And what's in it for him? Profit. 
Those machines are his creations, the work of scientists he holds imprisoned. And his attacks have every nation clamoring for the very weapons that assail them. Then it's a race for arms. And millions will perish. There's one last chance to avert war. The leaders of Europe are to meet secretly in Venice. And do you believe that this phantom will attack that conference? If he can find it. We need a team to get to Venice and stop him. This team will consist of six members. You'll have four days. Four days to get to Venice? It's impossible. Let me worry about that. Well, now, extraordinary gentlemen indeed. One of them is late. Parker, the chemist. Oh, chemist, eh? Do we get to blow something up then? My eyesight must be worse than I thought. No, your eyesight's fine. <laughs> No games, Anne. Some time ago, a talented, albeit misguided, man of science discovered the means to become invisible. Yes, I recall the tale, but didn't he die? Well, he did, but his process didn't. You see, I stole it, and here I stand for all to see. There's some parlor game. Believe it. <coughs> Easy now, Alan. I'm feeling a bit of a draft in my nether regions. And I must say, it's quite refreshing. Allow me to introduce myself. Rodney Skinner. Gentleman thief. Now, I thought invisibility would be a boon to my work. Well, you can imagine. It was my undoing. Once you're invisible, it's bloody hard to turn back. We finally caught him. And they'll provide an antidote. Well, that's if I'm a good boy. And are you a good boy? I guess you'll find out. Won't you? Am I late? A woman's prerogative, Mrs. Harker. Please tell me this is Harker's wife with a sick note. Sick would be a mild understatement. My husband's been dead for years. Gentlemen, Mrs. Wilhelmina Harker. Mina's prior acquaintance with a reluctant League member may prove useful. I'm waiting to be impressed. The fate of the world is at stake. There are still two more members to recruit. The clock hands turn, gentlemen. Kicking us out already? A moment ago, it was Sherry and Giggles. What in God's name is that? I call it an automobile. Yeah, but what is it? The future, gentlemen. The future. This is my first mate. Call me Ishmael, please.
Your little test, Mr. Q. Mrs. Harker, I doubt if you measure danger the way I do. And I imagine you with quite the library, Mr. Quartermain. All those books you must have read merely by looking at their covers. I've had women along on past exploits and found them to be, at best, a distraction. Do I distract you? My dear girl, I've buried two wives and many lovers, and I'm in no mood for more of either. You can send them my way. Skinner, right? shut up. Lady to me. This is the charming spot. Does Jack the Ripper live here? Good evening. Mr. Dorian Gray. We came by way of M. Oh. M for mystery. Well, I've told him and I'm telling you, I'm not interested. Dorian. Nina. Charming decor. Right, you're missing a picture, Mr. Gray. And you don't miss a thing, do you, Mr. Quartermain? Oh, sometimes. Scotch, anyone? Please, help yourself. Don't let it ruin your makeup. I am impressed, Mr. Gray. You take Skinner's uniqueness in your stride. Yes, well, I've seen too much in my life to shock easily. Although I must say I was surprised to see you again. When our last parting was such sweet sorrow. Oh, so you're nothing more than an enticement. Nevertheless. Your presence intrigues me. They say you're indestructible, Quartermain. Well, a witch doctor did bless me once. I had saved his village. He said Africa would never allow me to die. But you're not in Africa now. No. I confess a curiosity as to what the files say about Mr. Gray. We all of us have traits useful in this endeavor. A hunter, scientist, even Skinner has stealth. Cheers. What of you? I have experience. Gray and I have met before, many years ago at Eton College. A lecture, no doubt. You, the nation's hero. Dorian, the eager listening boy. Quite the reverse. 
It was Gray visiting Eaton. And I was the boy. What is it? Gray? They're not mine. They're mine. First meetings usually warrant introductions. Of course. I am the Phantom. You are the League of so-called extraordinary gentlemen. Introductions made. Oh, and I'm scarred, Mr. Quarterman. Not blind. Drop the gun. Your mission is to stop me. That, of course, I cannot permit. So I give to you all special one-time invitation. Join me. You think we'll help start a war that will consume the planet? While well, you profit from your arms race? I cannot deny that fortunes are made in war. Imagine the riches the world war will yield. He's not wrong. Speak for yourself.
are you? <laughs> I'm complicated. <laughs> I was special. You were invulnerable to harm. I don't like to boast. What happened to Mina? Oh, she's probably hip deep in some sort of trouble. Don't be such an alarmist, Mr. Q. And my hips are none of your business. Suit! Go on. guessed as much that they would do anything to protect you you know that's your biggest mistake thinking that I need them to protect me <laughs> <laughs> Told me European women had funny ways. <laughs> you missed a spot. Excuse me. And you are? Special Agent Sawyer. Of the American Secret Service. When America is aware of the situation. Well, if war starts in Europe, how long is it gonna take until it crosses the Atlantic? I followed you. I knocked out a straggler and I took his place. Very noble. But this is a private party and you're not invited. Actually, Dorian has declined. So we are one shy of a full deck. On the contrary, the battle was just the spur I needed. That and the thrill of a friendship renewed. So you're not needed. Winchester. That's right. It's modified. American style. American style shooting, too. <laughs> well, whatever it takes. You like it? I brought two. You're in. So, what's the next port of call? Paris. Just one last member to recruit. Capture is more the word, and it will be quite a hunt. You make him sound like some kind of animal. Oh, speaking thus, Mrs. Harker, your conduct uh, a moment ago? Indeed. We rule a quiver with curiosity. My husband was Jonathan Harker. Together with a professor named Van Helsing, we fought a dangerous evil. It had a name. Dracula. He was Transylvanian. Mmm. European? One of those radicals the newspapers love to report on? I don't know, Mr. Skinner. Is the vampiric sucking of people's blood radical behavior? Oh. 
Our transportation is forthcoming. A boat? It travels on water, if that's what you mean. And beneath it. see what we need a big monkey for. Well, this big monkey has terrorized the room morgue for months. Imagine the mayhem he'll give the enemy. <laughs> he missed! I'm not trying to hit him. Turn left, Mr. Hyde. Make him turn left, boy! If you can't do it with one bullet, don't do it at all! He's doubled back! Precisely! Come on! open boy. Can't protect you all the time. He's afraid. I can't smell anything. to hide. This hunt's too dangerous for a woman. Even one such as you. Leave it to me. Dorian, a great white hunter's bagged his prize. Or well, the prize bagged him. Stay back if you value your life. <laughs> Better me than him. Well, this is nice. Mr. Hyde, you've done terrible things in England. 
so terrible that you fled the country. <laughs> and I'm ashamed to say that Her Majesty's government is willing to offer you amnesty in return for your services. You want to go home. Home. Home's where the heart is, that's what they say. And I have been missing London so. Its sorrow is as sweet to me as a rare wine. I'm yours. Hmm. Don't be afraid. Who says I'm afraid? You stink of fear! Quite the parlor trick. You wait to see my next one. your service. So, the league is set. And so is the date for the conference. We have three days. Three days? This can you do that? You underestimate the Nautilus, sir. You underestimate her greatly. assist me, Agent Sawyer. Heavy lifting. Oh. Light banner. I'm a useful kind of guy. You're sweet. And you're young. Neither are traits that I hold in high regard. Solar panels are fully charged. We'll be diving in a moment. Mr. Quartermain, 
Dr. Jekyll, Mr. Skinner. Captain. Nemo. the phantom stole from the Bank of England. These are copies. Da Vinci's blueprints of Venice. Its foundations and waterways. So he'll attack the conference by sea. my boot up your arse. Dinner is served, Mr. Quatermain. I can offer you a jacket if you require it. Oh, thank you, no. But uh, thank you for your uh, contribution so far. I may have been overly rude earlier when I called you a pirate. And I may have been overly charitable when I said I wasn't. But I try to live in the now where the ghosts of old wrongs do not abide. What of you? Oh, I don't believe in ghosts, although I've seen my share. Your past haunts you. Vanity, pride, uh, mistakes that uh, cost me someone dear. So now you throw yourself in harm's way. Oh, old tigers sensing the end are at their most fierce. And they go down fighting. I'm saying. Mm. Powder? You think sabotage? We ain't that far, of course. something? No. I was just wondering why he signed up for all this. Nemo told me you hate the British Empire. They called and I answered. Yeah, well, that ain't all of it, though, is it? Hello? Sorry I asked. A 
few years ago, the British approached me with a mission for queen and country. That sounds like the morning ride to work for you, I'd imagine. I signed on without hesitation. I even took my son along. I led, and my son followed. He died in my arms. After that, I washed my hands of England, the Empire, and uh, the legend of Alan Bloody Quatermain. Now, would you like to learn how to shoot? I can't already. Oh, I saw. It's very American. Fire enough bullets and hope to hit the target. Saw so, ya? Yeah. I'm talking about pipping the ace at 900 yards. Easy. And easy. So low. Aim. That's easy. Allow for wind target movement. Yeah, that's easy too. This is the part that's not. You have to feel the shot. Take your time with it. You have all the time you need. All the time in the world. Take your... <laughs> Too soon. But that was bloody close. And at 500 yards, too. <laughs> Again. Did you teach your son to shoot like this? Quartermain? Kali, goddess of death. Him who worships death, can we trust him? He's not the one I'm worried about. Identifying a powder that Mina found. Magnesium phosphorus. Photographers use it to create a flash. A camera, perhaps. It appears that someone wishes to capture this vessel's secrets. Why was 
was surprised you ultimately joined the League. I mean to undo the flaws in my character. I want to face my demons. And what do you know of demons? Do you recall a space on the wall of my home? The picture was missing. Although the picture is my portrait, I doubt you'd recognize the face upon it. Every year that passes, my portrait ages instead of me. When did you last see it? I dare not look upon it myself, or the magic of the painting would be undone. Nightcap. I'm not much of a drinker. Just a small one, then. We don't want blood everywhere, do we? Yeah, not of blood. Yes, Henry. Look, but don't touch. <laughs> That's your way. Yes, shut up. I won't be tripped again. Tripped? You've known what I was about each time you drank the formula. Liar! I'm a good man. A good man! Who's lying now? You want it even more than you want her. No! You can't shut me out forever. Drink the elixir. No! She barely even looks at you. Be quiet! <laughs> she looked at me! I'll not have the brute free upon my ship. Must I take drastic steps? I am in control. I very much doubt it. Your talk is all well and good, sir. But your own past is far from laudable. Clear with Da Vinci's blueprints and enough explosives. He could set a bomb that would blow Venice's foundations to rubble. He's gonna sink the whole city. Yes, and uh, spark off his world war. I'm afraid that's not the sum of our problems. Skinner. He's taken a vial of my formula. Are you sure? Who else? You've seen the way the sneaky black on operates.
Honorable. My God. We must locate that bomb. No further, Captain. All ahead, stop! the divers beneath the city. The explosives must be found. Aye, aye, sir. The city is vast. It could be anywhere. What about Skinner? I'd be alert for his treachery. Ah! One key building. Yes! Get ahead of the collapse and destroy the next building. We can interrupt the chain of destruction. With a beacon placed for the exact coordinates, I could launch a rocket and take out the domino. Well, that's ridiculous. We'd never get there in time. There would be no room for error, but I tell you it could work. What are you talking about? Gray's right! I'm an immortal, sir, not a gazelle. How can we outrun this? Care for a spin? Come on, Jekyll, get in. I'll need coordinates. Can you track the state? Of course. Then the car will be your target. Launch when you see the flare. Right. Jekyll, come on. We'll need hide. No. Hide will never use me again. Then what good are you? Straight ahead, then turn left. No, no, take a right after the canal port. You must turn left to get ahead of the car. Oh! Yeah! He must have told them we were coming! Get a clear 
a shock! They take the wheel! Sit down, you buffoon! I don't know how to drive this bloody thing! Sit down! Uh, got it! Save your bullets! These men are mine! Did you see that? Did you see what she just did? Keep your eyes on the bloody road! Whoa! Sh it's a gauntlet! The vampire lady has us covered! Has reached the carnival, Captain. Time to run it out. We tuned the tracer to the cast frequency. The rocket must be ready to launch. Aye, aye, Captain.
Venice still stands. You failed. You see yourself as the brave John Bull. But you're weak. The wrong from the memory of your son's death. You should have trained him a little better. You may as well have put the gun to his head and Pull the trigger yourself. Oh yes. I know all about you. I know all about your spy. Do you? Mr. Gray, what happened? Misadventure. Have the others returned? You're the first. Hopefully not the last. That bastard Skinner. A lot to answer for. Skinner? No. Me. Phantom is M. And the hunt is still on. What are you talking about? The Phantom is M. The very man who recruited us. Let me see. Oh. But how oh. get our answers? Where are the others? Dorian's missing in action. And Mr. Skinner must have fled when he realized we knew. Sawyer? He'll live to fight another day. Don't worry. I've had my full of throats for this evening. Come! All. What is it? The sound of treachery. We can track it. I intend to catch it.
That is us. That is the Nautiloid. We will be upon them soon. You okay? Uh, just a little shake. Mm. The noise came from this. A recording disc? Ready, Professor? Recording. Gentlemen, if you're hearing this, and every step leading up to it has gone as planned. And I've been true to the girls set to me. Yes, it's me, Dorian. As you know by now, I'm no loyal son of the Empire. In fact, my loyalty to Mr. M comes in no small part from his possession of something I hold very dear to my heart. Something I would do anything to regain. You are right. My ears hurt, it's nothing. Everything so far has been misdirection. Sanderson Reed, the assassins in Kenya, your recruitment and mission, the secret conference, a myth. Even the League itself. There is no League. There never was. It was a ruse to get me closer to my goal. He likes the sound of his own voice, doesn't he? You see, I want you, each of you, even tired old quarter men. Because he'll capture high where all others have failed. The question is why? Why all this mask and mystery? Because in the war to come, I intend to wield the greatest weapon of all. The power of the League itself. Oh, turn it off, Henry. Please turn it off. To that end, I set my wolf among you, sheep. Growl. Who we'll gain your trust? Quietly lead you astray. And all the while, I'll collect you. The parts of you I need. Nemo's science. Magnesium phosphorus. Skinner's skin sample. Ow! You scratched me. Jekyll's potion. And Mina's blood. He's stolen us. And we let him. If you fail to save Venice, then I get my war. And if you succeed, well, it's a small price to pay for Gray to go about his task. War will come, sooner or later. As inevitable as summer into autumn. Now some of you, perhaps Gautamain, if he isn't dead, will pause to ask why I'm letting you know all this. What fool reveals his stratagem before the game is over? It is over. For you. Because my voice isn't the only sound being made. While I've rambled on, a secondary layer of inaudible sound, higher than humans can hear, audible to dogs, lower animals, has been heard by crystal senses dotted about your vessel. Sensors attached to bomb. Bomb voyage. <laughs>
away! We have to stop us! We're taking in too much water! The controls are not responding! Primary engine room almost full! Aft bulkhead is open! Pump valves are jammed! Seal it off! But there are men in there, Captain! For the greater good, we must seal it! We can do it, Henry. What are you talking about? You know we can do it. Together. Let's not make a saint out of a sinner. Next time he may not be so helpful. Can we uh, still follow Gray? Or... Well, we were the faster, but now we're the tortoise to his hair. So we're done. No. We're alive. If Em has any ideas to the contrary, that gives us an edge. We're getting a signal. What's it say? Hello, my freaky darlings. Skinner? Uh, hiding on board Little Fish with Gray and M. On way to base. East by northeast. Follow my lead.
Good work. All of you. Captain? All ahead! Pull! If Skinner's headings are correct, we will pass through the treacherous Straits of Tartary and enter the Amur River, which empties out into the frozen lakes of Mongolia, virtually inaccessible to outsiders. Settlements. They're all deserted. Why deserted? Fear, no doubt. Summer retreat. This is where Skinner signaled he'd meet us. So we wait. Skinner? We heard a noise. It was nothing. Just an old tiger sensing his end. Perhaps this was not his time to die after all. I've been waiting a week to do that. Get a grip, man. Well, I thought I just did. Oh, Mina. Report. Well, hello to you too. And need I remind you, I am naked in the snow. I can't feel any of my extremities, and I mean any of them. With all the suspicion on the ship, 
I knew you wouldn't believe I wasn't a spy. Well, I thought it was best to disappear. So what are we dealing with? The fortress is vast. Furnaces produce iron for making M's weapons of destruction. They're pieced together on the factory floor by a private army of ruthless men who share his vision. But the worst was to come. In the dry dock, M's best minds, perverting his dream. Nautilus? Nautiloi. It's eight for now. What about the kidnapped scientists? Emma holds her family's hostage. The men work, or the women and children die. Monstrous. Well, that isn't the half of it. The scientists are forced to work night and day to make new versions of us. Invisible spies, an army of hides, vampiric assassins. M leaves for Europe today with a sample case of the chemicals to sell to the most eager nation. I'll not let my evil infect the world. Do you think any of us feel differently? Chimney pipes lace the buildings. And bombs in the furnaces would make quite a bang. But someone needs to blow that place to hell. And I am least likely to be seen. Skinner, I didn't know that you were such a barefaced liar. All that time pretending that you weren't a hero? Well, shut up or I'll come to my senses. Well, besides, any more like me, and I'll lose the franchise. No. This cannot be a hunt to the death. More's a pity. We must take M alive if his secrets are to be uncovered. Not Grey. He's lived long enough. No, oh, I'll handle him. No. Nemo, you and Hyde will free the prisoners. Sawyer and I will deal with them. Then the game is on. Do you mind? Night, night. Your painting's in your room. In return for the League. That was our deal, and I'm glad to see you honor it. So what now? London. I've had my fill of violence, now I'm in the mood for vice. You could stay. Share my dream. I've lived long enough to see the future become history, Professor. Empires crumble. There are no exceptions. You think you're better than me. You forget. I've seen your painting.
Skinner said, turn right at the column. Oh, great. Which one? This way. You lead, and I'll follow. The scientists. They are from Nemo. out. Let's hope Skinner's up to the task. Lord is fueled and ready. We have trouble. Trouble. I call it sport. Intruders! Indians! I think it's Captain Nemo and his men! The prisoners are escaping! How many times do I have to kill these cretins? Make this the last!
Do not move, Rem. Or would you prefer Professor James Moriarty? Hmm? James Moriarty. The so-called Napoleon of crime. That man died at Reichenbach Falls. He died, and I was reborn. <laughs> Watch out! Eyes open, boy. Can't protect you all the time. Hello, lover. You're alive. It's possible I can't die. Same could be said of you. Let's put it to the test. Mince. A woman's wrath. Oh, I'm petrified. <laughs> we'll be at this all day. <laughs> Bedroom, Nina. Does it give you memories? Or ideas? Ideas. If that had been permanent, I'd have been very upset. Your painting. Nearly one more time. Didn't think it'd be literally. Okay, Skinner. The hell are you doing here? What makes you think I'm Skinner? Huh? Oh, 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 oh.
Go! Quickly! Come on! You want more? you missed you spoke once of wanting to meet your demon Skinner? It's the last time I'll play with matches. The line, Moriarty. <laughs> to the death, but you'll need hide to make it mine. You'll be making his own fun. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. <laughs> 
Accelerated rate. He'll soon change back. get tired of being wrong. The League. Me. Skinner. Wrong. Wrong about your little American friend as well. You really think he's ready for action? I think you've trained him about as well as you trained your son.
from far. Take your time. You're ready. Take your time. This new century be your son, as the old one was mine. Remember, he swore Africa wouldn't let him die. I wish the old boy had been right. What's next? I have long hidden away from the world. Now I wish to see it anew as the century turns. You're all welcome to join me. We've all been hiding in one form or another. The Nautilus awaits. So who's coming? So long, old chap. Goodbye, Alan. Nautiloid is fueled and ready. We have trouble. Trouble. I call it sport. Intruders! Indians! I think it's Captain Nemo and his men! The prisoners are escaping! How many times do I have to kill these cretins? Make this the last!
scientists! Is that all you've got? Prefer Professor James Moriarty. Hmm? James Moriarty, the so called Napoleon of crime. That man died at Reichenbach Falls. He died, and I was reborn. <laughs> Watch out! Eyes open, boy. Can't protect you all the time. Fortune rewards the bold. If you require any help during the voyage, Mrs. Harder, just let me know. I'm curious how you think you could assist me, Agent Sawyer. Heavy lifting. Oh. Light banner. I'm a useful kind of guy. You're sweet. And you're young. Neither are traits that I hold in high regard. Solar panels are fully charged. We'll be diving in a moment. Mr. Quartermain, Dr. Jekyll, Mr. Skinner, Captain Nemo. the phantom stole from the Bank of England. These are copies. Da Vinci's blueprints of Venice. Its foundations and waterways. So he'll attack the conference by sea. my put up your arse. There in time. There would be no room for error, but I tell you it could work. What are you talking about? Gray's right. I'm an immortal, sir, not a gazelle. How can we outrun this? Care for a spin? Come on! 
Jekyll, get in. I'll need coordinates. Can you track the state? Of course. Then the car will be your target. Launch when you see the flare. Right. Jekyll, come on. We'll need hide. No. Hyde will never use me again. Then what good are you? <laughs> Then turn left. No, no, take a right after the canal port. You must turn left to get ahead of the canal. Oh! Yeah! Snipers! Damn, Skinner. He must have told them we were coming. Gentlemen, indeed. One of them is late. Parker, the chemist. Oh, chemist, eh? Do we get to blow something up, then? My eyesight must be worse than I thought. No, your eyesight's fine. <laughs> no games, Anne. Some time ago, a talented, albeit misguided, man of science discovered the means to become invisible. Yes, I recall the tale, but didn't he die? Well, he did, but his process didn't. You see, I stole it, and here I stand for all to see. This is some parlor game. Believe it. <coughs> Easy now, Alan. I'm feeling a bit of a draft in my nether regions. And I must say, it's quite refreshing. Allow me to introduce myself. Rodney Skinner. Gentleman thief. Now, I thought invisibility would be a boon to my work. Well, you can imagine, it was my undoing. Once you're invisible, it's bloody hard to turn back. We finally caught him. And they'll provide an antidote. Well, that's if I'm a good boy. And are you a good boy? I guess you'll find out. Won't you? Am I late? A woman's prerogative, Mrs. Harker. Please tell me this is Harker's wife with a sick note. Sick would be a mild understatement. My husband's been dead for years. Gentlemen, Mrs. Wilhelmina Harker. Mina's prior acquaintance with a 
reluctant League member may prove useful. I'm waiting to be impressed. The fate of the world is at stake. There are still two more members to recruit. The clock hands turn, gentlemen. Kicking us out already? A moment ago, it was Sherry and Giggles. I was special. You were invulnerable to harm. I don't like to boast. What happened to Mina? Oh, she's probably hip deep in some sort of trouble. Don't be such an alarmist, Mr. Q. And my hips are none of your business. Suit! Go on. Guessed as much. Vanity, pride, uh, mistakes that uh, cost me someone dear. So now you throw yourself in harm's way. Oh, old tigers sensing the end are at their most fierce. and they go down fighting. I'm saying. Hmm. Powder? You think sabotage? We ain't that far, of course.
Did you want something? No. I was just wondering why he signed up for all this. Nemo told me you hate the British Empire. They called and I answered. Yeah, well, that ain't all of it, though, is it? Hello? Sorry I asked. A few years ago, the British approached me with a mission for queen and country. That sounds like the morning ride to work for you, I'd imagine. I signed on without hesitation. I even took my son along. I led and my son followed. He died in my arms. No, this cannot be a hunt to the death. More's the pity. We must take M alive if his secrets are to be uncovered. Not Gray. He's lived long enough. No, oh, I'll handle him. No. Nemo, you and Hyde will free the prisoners. Sawyer and I will deal with them. Then the game is on. Do you mind? <coughs> night, night. <coughs> our deal and I'm glad to see you honor it. So what now? London. I've had my fill of violence, now I'm in the mood for vice. You could stay. Share my dream. I've lived long enough to see the future become history, Professor. Empires crumble. There are no exceptions. You think you're better than me. You forget. I've seen your painting. Skinner said, turn right at the column. The solar panels are fully charged. We'll be diving in a moment. Mr. Quarterman, Dr. Jekyll, Mr. Skinner, Captain Nemo.
Plans the Phantom stole from the Bank of England. These are copies. Da Vinci's blueprints of Venice. Its foundations and waterways. So he'll attack the conference by sea. Or it's my boot up your arse. Dinner is served, Mr. Quatermain. I can offer you a jacket if you require it. Oh, thank you, no. But uh, thank you for your... Uh, contribution so far. I may have been overly rude earlier when I called you a pirate. And I may have been overly charitable when I said I wasn't. But I try to live in the now where the ghosts of old wrongs do not abide. What of you? Oh, I don't believe in ghosts, although I've seen my share. Your past haunts you. And they're at their most fierce. And they go down fighting. I'm saying. Mm. Powder? You think sabotage? We ain't that far, of course. Want something? No. I was just wondering why he signed up for all this. <laughs> Nemo told me you hate the British Empire. They called and I answered. Yeah, well, that ain't all of it, though, is it? Hello? <laughs> Sorry I asked. A few years ago, the British approached me with a mission for queen and country. That sounds like the morning ride to work for you, I'd imagine. I signed on without hesitation. I even took my son along. I led and my son followed. He died in my arms. After that, I washed my hands of England, the Empire, and uh, the legend of Alan Bloody Quatermain.
You... You don't know the whole of me. The Phantom is M. And the hunt is still on. What are you talking about? The Phantom is M. The very man who recruited us. Let me see. Oh. But how oh. get our answers? Where are the others? Dorian's missing in action. And Mr. Skinner must have fled when he realized we knew. Sawyer? He'll live to fight another day. Don't worry. I've had my full of throats for this evening. Come! What is it? The sound of treachery! That isn't the half of it. The scientists are forced to work night and day to make new versions of us. Invisible spies, an army of hides, vampiric assassins. M leaves for Europe today with a sample case of the chemicals to sell to the most eager nation. I'll not let my evil infect the world. Do you think any of us feel differently? Chimney pipes lace the buildings. And bombs in the furnaces would make quite a bang. But someone needs to blow that place to hell. And I am least likely to be seen. Skinner, I didn't know that you were such a barefaced liar. All that time pretending that you weren't a hero? Well, shut up or I'll come to my senses. Well, besides, any more like me, and I'll lose the franchise. No, this cannot be a hunt to the death. Most a pity. We must take M alive if his secrets are to be uncovered. Not Gray. He's lived long enough. No, oh, I'll handle him. No. Nemo, you and Hyde will free the prisoners. Sawyer and I will deal with them. Then the game is on. Do you mind? It's not night. Your painting's in your room. In return for the League. 
was our deal, and I'm glad to see you honor it. So what now? London. I've had my fill of violence, now I'm in the mood for vice. You could stay. Share my dream. I've lived long enough to see the future become history, Professor. Empires crumble. There are no exceptions. You think you're better than me. You forget. I've seen your painting. So, the League is set. And so is the date for the conference. We have three days. Three days? <laughs> Can this canoe do that? You underestimate the Nautilus, sir. You underestimate her greatly. Mrs. Harder, just let me know. I'm curious how you think you could assist me, Agent Sawyer. Heavy lifting. Oh. Light banner. I'm a useful kind of guy. You're sweet. And you're young. Neither are traits that I hold in high regard. The solar panels are fully charged. We'll be diving in a moment. Mr. Quartermain, Dr. Jekyll, Mr. Skinner, Captain Nemo. job reminding me but with each past exploit I've lost friends white men and black and much more and I'm not the man I once was the gentleman of the day what you're saying is yes, the long exactly, haul. Exactly. Mr. Quartermain? Uh, yes, indeed, sir. <coughs> wrong Quartermain! That's him! Get down! They're indestructible! No, just armor plated. Oh. 
automatic rifles. Who in God's name has automatic rifles? Yes, I'm sporting. Probably in Belgium. Wasn't there another one of these buggers? Mr. Quatermain! What trouble? Don't be such an alarmist, Mr. Q. And my hips are none of your business. Shoot! Go on! Just as much that they would do anything to protect you. So you know that's your biggest mistake. Thinking that I need them to protect me. <laughs> 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 Told me European women had funny ways. You missed a spot. Excuse me. And you are? Special Agent Sawyer. Of the American Secret Service. When America is aware of the situation. Well, if war starts in Europe, how long is it gonna take until it crosses the Atlantic? I followed you. I knocked out a straggler and I took his place. Very noble. But this is a private party and you're not invited. Actually, Dorian has declined. So we are one shy of a full deck. On the contrary, the battle was just the spur I needed. That and the thrill of a friendship renewed. So you're not needed. Winchester. That's right. It's modified. American style. American style shooting, too. <laughs> well, whatever it takes. You like it? I brought two. You're in. So, what's the next port of call? Paris. Just one last member to recruit. Capture is more the word, and it will be quite a hunt. You make him sound like some... The narrow I left, Uncle Captain. 
That's all I'm saying. Hmm. Powder? You think sabotage? We ain't that far, of course. Did you want something? No. I was just wondering why he signed up for all this. Nemo told me he hate the British Empire. They called and I answered. You know, that ain't all of it, though, is it? Hello? Sorry I asked. A few years ago, the British approached me with a mission for queen and country. That sounds like the morning ride to work for you, I'd imagine. I signed on without hesitation. I even took my son along. I led and my son followed. He died in my arms. After that, I washed my hands of England, the Empire, and uh, the legend of Alan Bloody Quatermain. Would you like to learn how to shoot? I can't already. Oh, I saw. It was very American. Uh, fire enough bullets and hope to hit the target. Saw so, ya. Yeah. Really? That's so frightening. Don't wander off.
Where's Quatermain? Ah, the gentleman at the back. Do I have the pleasure of addressing Alan Quatermain? Uh, yes, you do, sir. Indeed, you do. You're not what I expected. And I presume you're another traveler. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't there another one of these buggers? Mr. Quatermain! Bruce Matilda. Our friend might have some information. But he's so far away. Yes. I thought he was. Getting old. Did you mean to just wound him? Obviously. Stop him! I need information. love for the Empire, but I know you love Africa. A war in Europe will spread to its colonies. It appears the war has arrived. They're moving out. Let's hope Skinner's up to the task.
is fueled and ready. We have trouble. Trouble. I call it sport. Intruders! No further, Captain. All ahead, stop! the divers beneath the city. The explosives must be found. Aye, aye, sir. The city is vast. It could be anywhere. What about Skinner? I'd be alert for his treachery. Ah! Oh, I've been waiting a week to do that. Get a grip, man. Well, I thought I just did. Ooh, Mina. Report. Well, hello to you too. And need I remind you, I am naked in the snow. I can't feel any of my extremities, and I mean any of them. With all the suspicion on the ship, 
I knew you wouldn't believe I wasn't the spy. Well, I thought it was best to disappear. So what are we dealing with? The fortress is vast. Furnaces produce iron for making M's weapons of destruction. They're pieced together on the factory floor by a private army of ruthless men who share his vision. But the worst was to come. In the dry dock, M's best minds pervert Nino's dream. Nautilus? Nautiloi. It's eight for now. What about the kidnapped scientists? Emma holds her family's hostage. The men work, or the women and children die. Monstrous. Well, that isn't the half of it. The scientists are forced to work night and day to make new versions of us. Invisible spies, an army of hides, vampiric assassins. M leaves for Europe today with a sample case of the chemicals to sell to the most eager nation. I'll not let my evil infect the world. Do you think any of us feel differently? Chimney pipes lace the buildings. And bombs in the furnaces would make quite a bang. But someone needs to blow that place to hell. And I am least likely to be seen. Skinner, I didn't know that you were such a barefaced liar. All that time pretending that you weren't a hero? Well, shut up or I'll come to my senses. Well, besides, any more like me, and I'll lose the franchise. No. With a professor named Van Helsing, we fought a dangerous evil. It had a name, Dracula. He was Transylvanian. Mmm, European. One of those radicals the newspapers love to report on. I don't know, Mr. Skinner. Is the vampiric sucking of people's blood radical behavior? Our transportation is forthcoming. A boat? It travels on water, if that's what you mean. And beneath it. need a big monkey for. Well, this big monkey has terrorized the room ward for months. Imagine the mayhem he'll give the enemy. <laughs> Missed! I'm not trying to hit him. Turn left, Mr. Hyde. Make him turn left, boy.
If you can't do it with one bullet, don't do it at all. He's doubled back. Precisely. Come on. Look out. One bomb. Nemo. The bombs are at the city center. We must take out one key building. Yes. Get ahead of the collapse and destroy the next building. We can interrupt the chain of destruction. With the beacon placed for the exact coordinates, I could launch a rocket and take out the domino. Well, that's ridiculous. We'd never get there in time. There would be no room for error, but I tell you it could work. What are you talking about? Ray's right. I'm an immortal, sir, not a gazelle. How can we outrun this? Care for a spin? Come on, Jekyll, get in. I'll need coordinates. Can you track this thing? Of course. Then the car will be your target. Launch when you see the flare. Right. Jekyll, come on. We'll need hide. No. Hide will never use me again. Then what good are you? Straight ahead, then turn left. No, no, take a right after the canal port. You must turn left to get ahead of the car. Oh, oh! Yeah! He must have told them we were coming! Thank you. 
You broke my heart once. This time you missed. You spoke once of wanting to meet your demon. Skinner? They'll provide an antidote. Well, that's if I'm a good boy. And are you a good boy? I guess you'll find out. Won't you? Am I late? A woman's prerogative, Mrs. Harker. Please tell me this is Harker's wife with a sick note. Sick would be a mild understatement. My husband's been dead for years. Gentlemen, Mrs. Wilhelmina Harker. Mina's prior acquaintance with a reluctant League member may prove useful. 
I'm waiting to be impressed. The fate of the world is at stake. There are still two more members to recruit. The clock hands turn, gentlemen. Kicking us out already? A moment ago, it was Sherry and Giggles. What in God's name is that? I call it an automobile. Yeah, but what is it? The future, gentlemen. The future. This is my first mate. Call me Ishmael, please. I doubt if you measure danger the way I do. And I imagine you with quite the library, Mr. Quartermain. All those books you must have read merely by looking at their covers. I've had women along on past exploits and found them to be, at best, a distraction. Let my evil infect the world. Do you think any of us feel differently? Chimney pipes lace the buildings. And bombs in the furnaces would make quite a bang. But someone needs to blow that place to hell. And I am least likely to be seen. Skinner, I didn't know that you were such a barefaced liar. All that time pretending that you weren't a hero? Well, shut up or I'll come to my senses. Well, besides, any more like me, and I'll lose the franchise. No. This cannot be a hunt to the death. Most a pity. We must take M alive if his secrets are to be uncovered. Not Grey. He's lived long enough. No, oh, I'll handle him. No. Nemo, you and Hyde will free the prisoners. Sawyer and I will deal with them. Then the game is on. Do you mind? <coughs> night, night. <coughs> paintings in your room in return for the league that was our deal and I'm glad to see you honor it so what now London I've had my fill of violence now I'm in the mood for vice you could stay share my dream I've lived long enough to see the future become history, Professor. Empires crumble. There are no exceptions. You think you're better than me. You forget. I've seen your painting.
Go over, go! Quickly! Come on! You want more? you missed. You spoke once of wanting to meet your demon. Oh. 